So, if you guys have heard of sauna suits before, then the chances are you have heard of the brands Hot Suit and BVVU. And in today's video, we're gonna be reviewing both of their products and how they differ in terms of comfort, practicality, functionality, efficacy, so that hopefully after watching this video, you're gonna be in a better position to determine which is the product for you. So, let's kick things off. So I have used sauna suits for a while now. I've reviewed a hot suit product. I've also used BVVU's product. And if you wanna check out those in-depth reviews of those videos, there's a playlist up there which you can check out after watching this video. And I have had a lot of success using sauna suits. I find them very effective in shredding, losing rapid amounts of water weight. But having used the products, it has kind of emphasized to me the main kind of issues that you will face when using a sauna suit. And in this video, I'm gonna be talking about five of those main things. And we're gonna look at how Hot Suit and BVVU have addressed those issues with their products. So that hopefully after watching this video, you can make the most objective decision as to which is the right product for you. So let's get into number one. So first off, let's talk about does it work? I think the best way of answering that is how is a sauna suit different to any other kind of gym wear? And that is essentially the inner lining. It's this heat sensitive polymer fabric which is present within both of these products. And what this is designed to do is to increase your rate of perspiration by up to five times. Now that's gonna be very hard to experiment with in this video or any other video, but having used these products in previous videos, you will see that I lost rapid amounts of water weight, and I'm talking a kilogram within a 20 minute period. I actually found that the same happened within the hot suit video and also when I used the BVVU product. So can I really determine which is the more effective? No, I can't. They do appear to be using the same very high quality material. So with that in mind, in terms of does it work? Yes, it does. But is one better than the other? I can't distinguish between the two. I think they are both great products. Right, so number two on that list is movement. Do I feel restricted in my movement using these products? Now, when you're using a sauna suit, obviously you're gonna be sweating more, there's gonna be a lot more water buildup in your legs and in your body, and that is potentially going to lead to that material sticking and you feeling a little bit restricted. Now, one of the main areas that you're gonna be sweating, especially if you're a kickboxer or you're doing MMA, it will be around the crotch area. So, what have BVVU done as opposed to hot suit? Well, in their pants, they have actually introduced this sort of honeycomb breathable stretch material within the crotch region, which is going to act as a sort of area that the sweat can be released. So there's not gonna be a massive water buildup in that area. And to be honest, when I was doing some kicking motions, I was doing my stretches, I definitely felt a lot more confident using the trousers of the BVVU products, as opposed to using the hot suit sauna suit when, you know, I was doing those stretches, I was doing those kicks. I wasn't fully able to focus on my technique because I was a little bit conscious of whether or not I could end up tearing those pants. However, if you're gonna be using these products for specifically running, let's say, I wouldn't say that was much of an issue. I didn't notice the crotch region was an issue when using the hot suit sauna suit. I would definitely say in terms of which one gets the advantage, I'd say BVVU wins on that. 
Now, in terms of design and aesthetics, that's completely subjective. I think both of these products do look really good. When we talk about comfort, we're talking more about the seams. And that is because when you are working out using a sauna suit, you're gonna be sweating more and over a prolonged duration, those seams can tend to start rubbing, can essentially result in maybe a heat rash. I have never had that happen to me because I haven't actually used a sauna suit for long enough to have that kind of experience. However, if we look at both the seams of these materials, the BVVU jacket has this soft material covering the seam, whereas the hot suit jacket doesn't. Now, I can't say that when I did my run and did my workouts that I actually felt any kind of heat rash, any kind of rubbing at all. They both performed very, very well in their own rights. If you were using these sauna suits for a prolonged duration, maybe that would become an issue over time. So with that in mind, I would say to future-proof yourself, if you are gonna be doing longer workouts, I would probably suggest that the BVVU option is probably better, but for short workouts, 15, 20 minute runs, I think you'll be fine with both products. Right, next, let's talk about portability. Now, this isn't the end of the world. This isn't gonna make a massive difference to your workout, of course, but I do think it's just a nice little addition. Now, especially when you're wearing a sauna suit, you're gonna be sweating a lot. You're gonna be sweating a lot more than you normally do. And I don't particularly want to be commuting to the gym, wearing my sauna suit, so I'm gonna be sweating, feeling a bit sticky before my workout, because that's gonna put me in a bad mood and not put me in the right kind of headspace for my workout. But if you're going to be packing your hot suit jacket in your bag, you are just going to be throwing it in there or folding it up and it's just going to sit in there. However, with BVVU's jacket, I do really like this little attention to detail. They have actually designed their jacket in a way that means you can package this jacket up into the front pocket. So, if you want to pack your bag up before you commute to the gym, you can just slide this nice little square, just like that, into your bag in a nice and neat and tidy way, just like that. And to be honest, look, it really isn't the biggest deal, but I do really like that. And it is a great feature that the material used is also waterproof. So you don't have to worry about all of that sweat buildup resulting in you getting soaked. And the sweat won't soak the pack. So look, I do think with that in mind, the point for portability does go to BVVU. Now, last of all, we're gonna be talking about practicality of these two sauna suits. Without question, all sauna suits, all gym wear always needs pockets because everybody's gonna be carrying a phone, a music device, their AirPods. Both of the trousers come with some really cool invisible pockets. So, you know, it's perfect to slide your phone in. That is great. However, if you're looking for the extra pocket on the hoodie, you're not actually gonna get that with the hot suit sauna suit. You're only gonna get the ones with pockets in your trousers. However, on the BVVU products, their black one has two pockets either side, which I like. And the gray one has that pouch on the chest area where maybe you can slide a notebook or some pieces of paper so you can write down your workout maybe. But also, not just the pockets, if we talk about hoods. Now, with hot suits jacket, that hood is there permanently. However, if you purchase the black BVVU hoodie, you'll notice that the hoodie is actually detachable. And I think that is great because not always do you wanna wear your hood up. Sometimes you might find that it is making the workout a bit too difficult and you want the ability to just take it off because I can see sometimes if you're doing, you know, a bit of MMA fighting or sparring, boxing, that hood, if you're not wearing it, could potentially get in the way. So I guess, for practicality in terms of the pockets, in terms of the hood feature that is detachable, I guess we'd say BVVU wins on that one. And there we have it. That was the five things that I find when you're wearing a sauna suit may be problematic to you. And hopefully in this video, I have addressed how hot suit 
and BVVU have addressed these issues with their products. And hopefully now having watched this video, you can decide which is the product that you're going to purchase. Now with this video, you probably noticed I have tried to be as unbiased as I possibly can by justifying all my rationale, but this was sponsored by BVVU. So if you want to pick up one of their products from their website, use the link in the description below. If you have enjoyed this video, also remember to subscribe by hitting that red button down below and also tap that bell notification so you get notified every time I post a new video to the channel. If you've enjoyed it as well, hit that like button. That also helps. But as always, I will see you next week. Whew.